it's what you can do within those boundaries that really makes you a creator. Today, I'm going to share with you tips and advice for songwriting. Songwriting has become one of my favorite things to do. It is a lifestyle. It's kind of like journaling, self-expression, in the most wonderful forms. To start off, Usually, I feel like songwriting already, so I set out with the intention that I'm going to write a song today. I usually like to go to the woods, to a nice secluded spot, find myself a beautiful area where no one's going to bother me, and I get comfortable. Really, it's simple. As long as there's not a lot of people around, I feel like I can be myself. knowledge is is restricted of music but I still am limitless in what I can do with that somebody can know a thousand songs a thousand box songs on piano and not be able to songwrite I think songwriting is more than just knowing music theory music theory helps in my case I'm bound by the limited knowledge I know of music you don't need to be a super hardcore musician to do it. Usually I start with the chords first and then start freestyling. Then when I'm ready and I start hearing words inside my head, I just kind of sing out what I'm feeling. When I realize that I'm onto a good idea, I definitely write it down. I find that writing things down helps me repeat it over and over again into memory. repeating a line a couple of times, I've usually committed it to memory, and from there, I just keep going. However, I'm not going to show you all of the times that I repeated lines, I'm just going to show you what I ended up with. up in the beginning a few times before I learned the song.
songwriting for me is channeling something beautiful and finding peace within myself. The song isn't complete. They never are. A song, an artwork, piece of artwork, a construction project, they're never fully complete. You can always do something more, but at some point you have to accept that it's great how it is. When I first started making music, I found that I was I was accustomed to want to go buy something fancy or buy something um, like a new piece of music equipment that might make me feel like I have more abilities, but in reality it didn't help me very much and I just ended up spending more money. So, you know, there's that guy that plays a guitar with one string and he's got millions of views. You know, it's, it's not about how nice your guitar is or how expensive your gear is or it's not even about how big your crowd is who you play for or who knows your name it's how about how you make people feel in the moment i would rather inspire one person than sing to a group of a hundred people who didn't actually hear me unfortunately my camera died soon after this but i just wanted to sign off with peace and love and hopefully i'll see you again subscribe and like